happy Tuesday. So I didn't film at all yesterday. I just spent the day with my husband and then I worked yesterday. I did three to close. So um, obviously I was working and then I came home and then I crashed. Like I've been so stinking tired lately. Um, but so today is Valentine's Day, February 14th. Um, my husband and I, we just talked on the phone this morning. I ran to Target. From Target, I picked up some cat litter. Um, I got a gallon of water uh, so I can use my miracle Grow stuff. And then I got two packs of Colgate Wisps. Um, just so when I get my liners and I'm at work, I can like actually take care of my liners, do what I need to do with them. Um, but yeah. So I'm going to change angles real quick and I've really been dying to try the viral dirty coke. So let me get set up and I'll be right back. So like I said, I'm going to make a dirty coke or a dirty soda. So the ingredients that I saw on TikTok that you need is a cup of ice, any soda. I heard uh, coke is the best, but I had diet cola, um, not the glass bottle, but I heard glass bottle is the best. I don't know why around here I can't find the glass bottle. Lime. And then they said French vanilla or coconut. I have, this is what I've been using. I just want to use it up. It's the Sweet and Creamy International Delight. Tonight, while I do this, I'm getting Texas Red House for dinner since it is Valentine's Day. I don't feel like cooking um, just because it's Valentine's Day. So um, I will let you guys know what I get from Texas Roadhouse later tonight. And I'm also getting a new laptop. One, I need it for school. Two, um, I just don't think my Mac is gonna hold up much longer. So, got my lime cut up. I quartered it just so if I do like it, I can have at least three more drinks. So, crack this bad boy open. Um, also, I'm currently getting the last two. I'm getting caught up. Don't worry, guys. Um, the last two vlogs are going up now. I'm very, I'm very cautious of trying this, but I love trying new things. So, squeezing in my lime. Which this shouldn't be any different than like cream soda, you know? And then, I don't know how much of this you're supposed to put in. We're gonna do about that much. All right. Let's see how this tastes. Oh my gosh. That is so good. So yes, dirty sodas, chef's kiss. So I'm gonna finish cleaning my house. Um, get stuff ready for later tonight just so i can have a peaceful night and i will see you guys probably when i get back from walmart and texas roadhouse i just got back from picking up my dinner and i went to walmart and got my new laptop so i thought i was wanting to go with something like this it was like a geo or something like that i only liked it because it was touchscreen and it was blue um, but I didn't take into consideration of everything that goes with it. Um, but I thought it was going to be good for like school and stuff. Um, still had the same amount as gigabytes as the one that I went with. Um, like I said, the only difference is, well, it, it was touchscreen and you could flip it into like an iPad kind of thing. Um, and the screen size was smaller. So I actually went with the Acer Chromebook 315 
it is bigger um same amount of um uh gigs so uh it is 2022 so let me go ahead and open it for you guys this is what it looks like so i'm gonna show you guys what i got from texas roadhouse too don't worry i just tried to get everything before before five o'clock because I don't like waiting at the gate at five o'clock just because everyone's trying to get through and end of work end of work day stuff like that so i was thinking about having to get a case for it but it looks like it comes with its own laptop sleeve which i love um i might still get like a hard case for it just because i'm that type of person this is what the case looks like. I like it. So I'm just gonna show you guys it. Of course it comes with a charger, but I'll set it up later. So this is what it looks like. Because it's thin and it just looks like this. So maybe I'll be able to do some stuff with it later on. But this is my new laptop. Of course, charger and startup guide. All right, and of course, Texas Roadhouse for dinner. I usually get um, like a combo meal. So I got rolls, obviously, and my ranch and butter is in here. I got the uh, blossom, cactus blossom, which is in here. I'll just open it and look at all of its glory. Cactus Blossom. And I wanted best of both worlds. I was like, well, I kind of want ribs, but I also want chicken critters. So I got uh, chicken critters and ribs with some fries. And I got an extra side of shrimp and then I got an extra side of fries. So I'm going to eat and then probably set up my laptop. Good morning guys, happy Wednesday. So we're starting off the day in bed. I don't have to leave for work, probably like another 15, 20 minutes. Um, Sissy's here. Um, I'm trying to be in my best boot barn attire. Um, because our district manager is on his way to the store and he'll be here for most of the day and um i'm just not ready for my energy to be super drained on a day back I'm not super ready for that um i just might change the kimono because i don't know how he would feel about like the tank top i mean i'm covered but just want to be 110 percent um as for my liners they're either going to be here today or tomorrow so we'll do an unboxing when i get those um i work 11 to 6 today and then i also work 11 to 6 tomorrow and then i open saturday so what do you have to say what do you think? Did you have a good night? Did you sleep good last night? I know she slept good last night because she was all up in my ribs. And when she's all up in my ribs, that's how I know you're sleeping good. That's how I know you're sleeping good. Did my nails last night um, yellow? Not, I don't know. I just wanted yellow nails, but I wanted like pastel maybe something vibrant but i think they look cute i just clean my ring set and then i'm wearing my class ring on this finger which you can tell i need to lose weight because this is always like not snug on my hand i'm going to finish getting ready i'll probably throw a jacket over on top of this instead it's super super rainy and gloomy here today 
I gotta bring the trash bins up and it's just, I'm gonna make it a good day. I'm taking my leftover Texas Roadhouse for lunch and then tonight I think I'm doing cheesy chicken parmesan baked potatoes. So I will probably see everybody later. So I just got home from work, um, picked up some stuff at work just cause I'm redoing my wardrobe. Um, and I wanna show you guys what I got. So I got this top by Idolin, fueled by Miranda Lambert. It's this little number here, which I think is fun and cute. Um, just looks like that. And then I'm done spending until my next paycheck. I'm trying to get myself to like dresses. So I picked up this dress, which I think is really cute. Um, has a daisy print on it. It's also by um, Idle Win by Miranda Lambert. And then I picked up this freaking adorable, could be like an off the shoulder kind of thing. Um, so, but yeah, that is what I got from work. Um, it was really, really slow. Our DM was here today. We have little kitty in the bag. <laughs> what are you doing, Will? She loves paper bags. What are you doing? What are you doing, my little one? What are you doing? Are you having fun? She, like I said, loves paper bags. So she loves paper bags, always has since she was a kitten. I mean, she still is a kitten, but when she was like yay big, Loved them. They're her favorite thing, especially when we bring them home. Like she's playing with it right now. But I'm going to try on these dresses and probably make something to eat for dinner. I have a migraine, so I'm not super, super hungry. Um, tomorrow, my aligners should be here from Smile Dark Club and I'll open those with you. Um, so yeah, I will probably see you guys before I go to bed. Happy Thursday guys. So today I do have to work. I am all ready for work. Um, I'm wearing this uh, maroon like crisscross high neck tank top with this camisole. It's like 65 out today. My hair is in a claw clip. I'm going to take it out before I go and drive because I don't know if you've seen on TikTok about this doctor that uh, said uh, if you get in a car accident and you're wearing a claw clip, it can impact your skull. So, and then of course I'm wearing jeans and then my Cody James kids boots. Um, so for lunch, I made two wraps. Um, it's turkey bacon and provolone cheese wraps. And then I got some apples, uh, yogurt, some Annie's crackers. And then I also got took one of my cheesecake things. Um, I'm definitely gonna have to add those to my grocery list every time now because I love dipping apples in it. So that's what I have in my lunch. And then I have a cherry cola um, Zevia in there for a uh, drink. And then I'm taking my circle water bottle and then I made a dirty cola just to sip on going to work. And then of course, um, my circle water bottle is water. Um, I have strawberry kiwi flavor pod. It's a life sip that's in there. Um, but yeah, yesterday, I think I mentioned our district manager came yesterday. Everything went well with that. Um, right now we are just in the prime time of getting everything set up for inventory. So we're just waiting on that. Um, today my, uh, Smile Direct Club aligners should be here, so, um, I have everything prepped and ready for that. Like, I got, uh, Colgate Wisps so I can brush my teeth, like, after I eat, um, like they recommend to do. Um, I have floss picks in my bag, um, just, I made, like, a little care kit and stuff. So I can't wait to unbox that with you tonight when I get home 
from work they should be here by 7 p.m i probably won't get home till about 6 30 um but i am tracking the package just to make sure like nobody takes it or anything like that um so yeah i do have to head out the door in about five minutes so but yeah i will probably see everybody when i get home from work all right guys so i just got home my liners came so let's go ahead and get these open and i will show you all the details of what i'm going through all right so smile inside handle with care so we are gonna just open this bad boy up all right little bit of an angle change like i said i'm so excited to finally do this um, I do know I have to watch a video before I start any of this. Um, so, I don't know if you guys can see Willow. There's Willow. So, this is what the box inside of a box looks like. It says, open for a lifetime, supply of confidence. And, let's see if I can get this open. And I'm sorry if you hear noises in the background. Sissy's drinking. She just came in from outside. Willow is in the box. So here's this. So let's see what this little packet says up here. All right. So you have your aligner guide. Show off your smile moment, future web star. Take your before photos, so now you can show off your results later, and who knows, we may even feature you on our Instagram feed. So, have some aligner do's and don'ts. Um, just some accessories you can get for your aligners. Um, so, this is the aligner case which looks like this and then there is I don't know how to open it I guess there's a mirror under here a liner remover thing remover bob this is to help get the aligners out of my mouth there is a emery board for um filing them if they are a little too sharp so these are to help get my liners in place. They're like little mints. I have some tablets to clean my liners. Another smile stretcher. Wax. Not too sure what the wax is used for. Pretty sure this is gonna be my new favorite chapstick. Let me try and little smile direct club. Ooh, it's vanilla scented. Love vanilla. Thanks, smile direct club. All right. So obviously, number one, my liners are in here. Number two is like I showed already, the aligner case. Number three, I have, if I can get it out, some teeth whitening. Number four, I, like I already showed y'all, an emery, emery board. Um, it uh, smooths any edges of the aligners. Wax is to soothe and dis and relieve any discomfort. This aligner tool will help me remove my liners without any hassle. There's instructions on here how to do it. Um, where did I put them? Cleaning tablets. These will help um, seat my liners in place. And then of course my lip balm so let me read over this and then we'll get started so by what the smile direct club app says to do is wash your hands brush and wash your teeth 
So I'm gonna do that and I'll be right back. The first thing that we do after I wash my hands and brush and floss my teeth is I'm going to take my liners and uh, wash them with gentle soap and warm, lukewarm water. Look at these, oh my God. Okay, I'll be right back. So now these are washed and clean and let me try and put my liners in for the first time. Oh my God. This feels so weird. <gasps> oh my God. I have aligners now. Oh my God. My teeth are gonna be so straight. I'm gonna have a lisp for like the longest time until I get used to these. Okay, now that they're in, let me see what else I have to do with these. All right, so I'm gonna put one of these movements in and what they're supposed to do is help guide my aligners into place and then I can just suck on this afterwards because it is a mint, so I think that these are comfortable enough. So now after I do this, I will let you guys know what I have to do next. Alright, so my liners are in. I don't think I have that bad of a lisp, so this is what they look like. It's definitely going to take some use to, like, getting used to. Um, so yeah, I am going to attempt to make dinner. I'm not that hungry, um, but I am going to make dinner and probably just relax. I know a thousand pound best friends are going to be on later tonight, so I'm definitely going to watch that. Um, but I'm just going to get ready for the rest of the evening. Tomorrow is Friday, so I do another 11 to 6 shift tomorrow, and then um, I open Saturday. So, um, yeah. So, for this first set, I have to wear for, I believe, one week. And then my next set, which I'm going to try and pull out here and the movement was not bad at all like trying to get them to sit in my teeth so let me see here on how long I have to wear my next ones I think I have to wear them for a week at a time I'm not too sure so it looks like I wear them for one week at a time so I'm going to put everything back in the box and put it somewhere safe um just so I know where I'm at um so it actually looks like my third aligner I wear for two weeks my fourth aligner I wear for one week aligner five for one week I probably shouldn't be taking all of this out, but I just want to see how long um, I need to wear each aligner. Just because I'm curious. I'm going to have 12 aligners. So, aligner 2 I'm going to wear for one week. Um, aligner 3 I'm going to wear for two weeks. Aligner 4 is one week. Aligner 5 is one week. Aligner six is two weeks. Aligner seven is one week. Aligner eight is one week. And then that's when I will hit the home stretch. Aligner nine, I'm gonna wear for two weeks. 
Um, and then after week not or a line or nine, that is when I will order my retainers. Um, a liner 10 is going to be for one week, a liner 11 is going to be for one week, and then a liner 12 is going to be for two weeks. So like I said, I'm just going to put everything back in this box. Um, make Probably I'm going to eat a bowl of cereal for dinner, to be honest. Throw on some comfy clothes because this bra, to be honest with you, is hurting the ever-living daylights out of me. So we are starting my new smile journey and I am so excited to actually have, I know it doesn't look like it, but actually have straight teeth. So yeah, like I said, I am going to get all that stuff done and I will probably see you guys tomorrow. Happy Friday. So today I am obviously working. I'm sitting in the car. Um, it is rainy and so, so gloomy out today. Um, <clears throat> I do have my eyeliners in. I slept with them in last night, just like they recommended me to do so. Um, but they, it felt weird sleeping with them in. <clears throat> I have chapstick on because they said my lips, that your lips are gonna get really dry while doing, um, your aligners so um i do have chapstick on i put chapstick on last night before i went to bed but yeah we are sporting glasses today because like i said it is raining and i just don't wear my glasses enough and i think i needed to give my eyes a break from my contacts so that means i will not be shaping hats tonight at work just because they will fog up my glasses so yeah i have my hair in a claw clip today um, <clears throat> I think for lunch, I either will get Panera because I've been craving Panera or Chinese food because I have really been craving Chinese food. It has been super dead here by the looks of it, so not too sure. Um, but yeah, the downfall is when I wear my liners, I can't chew gum and that's the one thing I like to do at work is chew gum not a lot has been happening um we did get some very shocking news that um i don't think i can share um my husband told me his higher up that from here went and deployed with um my husband and everybody i uh, told him and then my husband told me so i can't really say what happened but it's very very shocking we don't know why it happened but it did um so yeah, I'm just gonna sit here and continue listening to my Brooks and Dunn because I'm getting ready for the concert in May. Um, but yeah, that is what's going on and I will probably see you guys when I get home. All right guys, so I didn't end Friday and I haven't said anything today. So yesterday, obviously I worked uh, Cape Hope and then I literally relaxed and went to bed because I had to be at the store at 8 a.m. this morning to open so that's what I did today um it has been a long day I only worked 8 to 2 today um I don't have my retainers in just because I just ate dinner did I say retainers I mean aligners but um so far the past 48 hours with my aligners have been good. I haven't had any problems. Thursday, I can change into my second set of aligners. So, but after I got off of work today, I got home at like 2.30, I think. And then um, called my husband and then about... 3 34 o'clock i took a nap it's currently quarter to eight so took a took a little three four hour nap um so i just ate i'm not really hungry but um i ate some like cheez it's and a five or one bar um so i honestly might go make a pb and j eat that 
and then get ready to go to bed. I am currently watching 16 and Pregnant. I've been binge watching it on Paramount Plus for the past like week and a half just because my free trial is almost over and I want to watch everything I want to watch before my free trial, trial ends because I can't see myself um, paying the amount of money. Um, I can't see myself paying that amount of money for um, a TV subscription. So, I mean, maybe maybe one day I will actually get it. I mean, the only reason I can have it is because I wanted to watch the Teen Wolf movie. And I also kind of binged watch Top Gun Maverick, even though I own Top Gun Maverick. I am going to go make myself a sandwich but and eat that and just relax for the rest of the night. But, yeah. I also talked to my husband today, which was good. We're, we're slowly getting there till he can come home. And I'm so, so ready for him to come home. I, I miss him so much. So, yeah. But I'm going to go ahead and end this vlog here. If you guys enjoyed this video, please give it a big thumbs up. Leave a comment below on what types of videos you would like to see this month. And yeah, like I said, I will see you guys in the next video. Bye guys.